What's up, anyone? This is Amy from TUC077 here, and welcome to this video. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to install Chimera 3.0 on your Vibrant. Um, I'm pretty sure it's Angel 4.1.2 ROM. It's Angel 4.1.2, but the gaps are from Angel 4.2 Jellybean. It's still Jellybean, but they got new, like Gmail and whatever, are from Jellybean. I guess that's that's what I think because I downloaded it. The download says Angel 4.2 gaps. Okay, and I'm not pretty sure that it's Angel 4.2 gaps, but whatever. Okay, I'm pretty sure. I don't know. We're gonna just flash them and then we're gonna know. Now, um, what's Chimera? You don't know what Chimera is? Chimera is the ultimate ROM. It's it's awesome. Okay, now there was Chimera 2.2 on Angel. What well, was Angel 4.0? Chimera is basically through it is like yeah the best ROMs together. Now this Chimera 3.0 combines AOKP, CM10, and and Panaroid Android all in one. So you gotta get a AOKP's customization. You gotta get Panaroid Android DPIs, which you can make it tablet mode and whatever. And you're gonna get CM10's smoothness. Okay. Cause CM10s is like a little more stable than any other ROM out there. Now what you gotta do first is, of course, go ahead, back everything up, back everything you got, download Azure File Manager for it, and download those two. See those? Yeah, you gotta download them. It's gotta be in your downloads. Now you gotta say bye bye to everything right here. You gotta restore them, of course, but just say bye bye from right now. Go ahead, reboot to recovery. And then click reboot. Then it's gonna be rebooting. I'm so excited to get my hands on Chimera. Oh my god, I, I I was waiting so much for that ROM. I'm running right now. I was running right now, like this minute right here. I'll be running into AOKP. AOKP, okay. AOKP was fine, but uh, it's not so 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 stable. Sorry for the brightness right here. Um, you could barely see it. I know. What you gotta do is wait. Data factory factory reset. I'm gonna I'm gonna use my buttons here. You got wipe data factory reset. I'm using my buttons right here. This, this um, this clock wall, this CWM supports supports um uh, capacitive buttons. It's gotta be wiping your stuff. Now just wipe your cache partition. That's kind of recommended. Then wipe the cache. See it right here. Man. Okay, now go to install zip from SD card. Choose zip from SD card, and you now you gotta go to downloads. Find downloads. Shit. And then it's. Let me find it. It's the very last one. Vibrant Chimera 3.0. I know it's it's too it's too 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 bright. Vibrant Chimera 3.0. What you need to do is say bye bye to your current ROM and flash it. Now leave it alone. Flashing. Now it should be just flashing. I see it flashing right here, and it's gonna say installing this, installing update. I clearly expected a Roma installer here, but it's gonna take a little more time. But it could take a little more time to put stuff together in in um an Aroma installer. I really like the customization of our Aroma installer because I think you choose your install cause you choose if you want this, you want that, you, ch you choose it yourself. But yeah, it's just like Chimera 2.2. But it's okay. It's okay for the developers, which is, which are Team Passion. Um, actually, Team Passion developed this ROM. I want to say the name because somebody of them developed it, but maybe he, maybe whoever developed it, I don't know, I already know who he is. He doesn't want to mention his name in video in videos just in case. Yeah, uh, they 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 great. Okay. Um, Team Passion got the best ROMs ever. Well, they don't make 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 them, but they put them together and like edit them. Now what you gotta do is go back to 
choose zip from SD card you gotta go back to downloads and you gotta find let me find it first I remember the name was oh yeah you see um this tall thing right here it says 4.2 full at the end yep install this now it's gonna be installing it it's gonna say next gen 4.2 gaps by whatever 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 for all ROMs it's gonna say removing old files deleting old files you can go ahead if you want just the gaps you can just flash the gaps now yeah this is angel 4.2 gaps okay not angel 4.2 the whole operating system it's just the gaps okay just some special some just some mods I'm not pretty I'm, I'm, I'm not sure that you're gonna we're gonna get the multi-user function but I, I don't think so On, 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 I can't wait till it turns on. Like when they first said that they want to make a community point, oh, I thought they were just messing around, like just talking, you know. But they they really made it, cause like they had they just made Panaroid Android, yeah, and then they made it for the Vibrant and whatever. So I thought that they won't really make um camera three point oh like uh like I could I'm like, I, I don't know I just thought they 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 they're not gonna make it. I didn't say that they couldn't, I thought that they could not make it. I just said that they uh, thought that they're not gonna really make it. Now go to advanced, wipe Delve Cache, fix permissions, go back, reboot your phone, and let it reboot for like two, three, seven, eight minutes. Well, now it's seven minutes. If it stayed rebooting on like nine minutes, then I'm gonna just turn that off. Oh, 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 look what it says. It's a, it's a Steam Passion. That's so cool. I wanted to change the boot animation, but nah, I'm, not, I'm not changing that. It, it looks awesome. Seriously, it does. It glows. That's not any special thing, but I just. I, 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 I like the boot, anima boot animation. Should take a little while, it's okay. Don't worry. Took a lot, take out the battery. And if you want and if, if you're on a phone that you cannot take the battery out and it froze somewhere right here, well, what you need to do is hold down the, the power button ten seconds. Well the, you can well this is only for the vibrate so you can take take the battery out. Um I think I think I think I think I think they said that it's gonna come out for the Galaxy S2 Skyrocket and the Galaxy S2 from T-Mobile, the Hercules. I think. I, I'm, I'm not. I'm not a hundred percent sure. So, I'm gonna turn it on. Just give it a minute or two, cause this, this, this is the first boot. Ugh. If it's nine minutes, let me just turn off the camera and turn it back on. Well, it's not actually a camera; it's just a Galaxy S2. I, I, I take my videos from a Galaxy S2. It got a good camera. It's not bad, but it got a good camera. So it's about to be nine minutes. Prepare yourself. Oh, oh, oh here you go. See, it says Windows Live. Like what the fuck? It's an emergency dialer. It says Windows Live. Oh, look what the heck. Now let's go ahead. And it's, this is going to take a second because I don't have a SIM card. This could take a while. You're going to be customizing our notification, but we're going to be customizing everything. It's awesome. I was gonna say what's the most important thing in the but everything is important. Well, Panaroid Android is important for, for some people, but it's not so 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 important for me. If I had a phone like a like Galaxy Note 2, well, yeah, I, I would make my phone like a tablet, but this phone is just so small. Like it's four inch screen, it's not really big. Don't don't say that's big. It's not big. 
I, I, I like I like mixed screens. I don't know why. Urgh, I'm sorry because it takes long, but it's searching for a network. There it is. Skip it. Now they're gonna ask you for the thing. You could see that it's like a tablet. You could ch you could still change it, of course. Um, what's my, oh, 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 I got it, I got it. Gmail, let me put my Gmail. Should I put this or not? Okay, I'm going to just put. Okay, I'm almost done. It's signing in. No, I don't want to set up a credit card. Gonna be restoring your, my stuff. And now our setup is finally complete. Of course, our regular home screen, you click here and you find this. Oh, they got Chrome. You got Terminal Navigator. You got Voice Search Talk. You got everything that involves in the 4.1. We got a file manager. <laughs> Hold on, let me find something. I wanted to go to Gmail. No, I'm not supposed to show y'all, but it's okay. Okay, let's say you. Could, oh yeah, it's Angel 4.2 Angel 4 Gmail. Just swipe it away if you don't want it. Okay. And the camera is the same unless they have the new mode. No, it's, it's the same. And what's what else? Let's check out voice search. It won't work so well in the beginning. What time is it in New York? Well, if you want it to work, you gotta reboot it. If you want it to work, okay. It's not gonna work so well right now, but I'm I'm not gonna reboot it. So here are your settings, and here is your interface. You see lots of stuff. Now here's an example. You wanna change your settings to regular settings? Easy. You just go to Panoroid Android settings. You go to apps. It's gonna be loading your apps. It shouldn't take so long because you only got some apps. Now you go to it's, it's smooth. First boot though, but smooth. You go to settings, and you're gonna show you it's like that and like that. Then you make the DPI so high. And now here's 240, 720px. Make it 360x px. Highlight nav navigation bar. Highlight whatever. Force it. It's not a large screen. Okay, let's make it a large screen. Now you just click apply. I'm gonna tell you you gotta force stop. So, oh yeah, it's gonna ask you for your root. So it's gonna ask you for your root, and your root is uh, it's done. It should be done right now. Then click launch. Then it won't work the first time, of course. I just. I, I, I don't really work with DPI so much. Let's try it one more time. Sorry about this epic fail. Okay, now go to settings. Oh, we got launcher 7. That's Windows 7 launcher. 
settings. Three pictures of the Put OK. Now print the notification bar down. Go to your settings. And oh yeah, that is. Um, the best thing here is interface. You could I I I don't think that you could overclock it. Even if you could overclock it, do not overclock it. Okay, I I never recommend it to overclock. Or you could overclock it. Okay, now this was Dark Crazy Seventy Seven. Go ahead and check out the ROM by yourself. It got lots of stuff in it, including Wi-Fi. <laughs> Just kidding. Yeah, it got system, it got ROM control, it got, it got system, it got lock screen, it got themes, Panaroid, Android, it got perform, yeah, it's a good thing, and advanced, of course. This was an Arcade 77, thanks for watching, this is the ultimate ROM, it combines three ROM together, Panaroid, Android with AOKP with Cyan Cyanjin Mode 10, okay, and thanks for watching, hit that subscribe button, and your 4.2 coming soon to Vibrant, hopefully. Thanks for watching, everyone.